First, I just want to thank the players and the coaches uh, on their toughness, on their resolve, uh, on their fight. Um, did what we had to get done. You know, we needed stops in the second half. We needed drives in the second half. I uh, want to thank them. Uh, also, I can't tell, possibly tell you how much winning the George Hallis uh, trophy means to me personally. Uh, and I just thank the players and the coaches on this team for getting that done. When your my question was the second one. I thank them for their toughness. I, I understand. <laughs> the resolve. You're doing great. <laughs> did you build them to be that way? This team that way? This is a, it's a Anytime you win a game like this, it's a team effort. Uh, everybody does a little, it adds up to be a lot. Uh, you know, this one built by, by any one person. Um, tremendous, uh, tremendous, tremendous win for us. Uh, showed the heart and resolve of the team. And uh, we'll move on with, you know, continue in our humility and uh, be ready to play another game in two weeks. How do you account for the first half you guys couldn't stop them and the second half you guys pitched a shutout? Uh, we, we needed to cover better and, and rush better in, in the first half. and. Uh, they were doing a perfect job. Uh, you know, Matt Ryan and his receivers were perfect. Uh, Julio Jones and Gonzalez and White uh, throwing throwing the balls where only they could catch them. Uh, I mean, it was it was perfection. What we needed we needed stops. We needed to rush the passer, and we started we started rushing them uh, better in the second half and uh, getting our hands on balls. Uh, their pass game was what, what was hurting us and, and what we needed to get stopped in the second half. And we got those critical stops with the two turnovers and then, then the stop at the end. Did you, bring more, did you bring more than four guys to get pressure on them? Yes, at times. Jim, what, were you, what were you thinking down 0-17? Uh, coming out of halftime, the offense had to look at it like a shootout. And the defense, uh, we had to get stops any way we could get them. You well, coaching you, in the uh, uh, NFC Championship game last year, help you this year? Did coaching last year in the, in the game against the Giants, did that help you at all? Possibly. How, how, so given everything, how comfortable were you there in that la those last few minutes on the last time the Atlanta was in the red zone with your defense on the field? How comfortable were you? Boy, if you just phrase that with a different word, comfortable, comfort, <laughs> it's, just, it's just a word that just is not in football lexicon. It's, I mean, you never are. And uh, so it's, uh, you know, we, we rose up there at the end. I mean, that was a, you know, a great finish for our defense. They put an exclamation point on the game and, uh, and got the stop. Jim, you mentioned Collins bouncing back from interceptions leading to touchdown drives. He bounced back from two 17-point deficits both times he leads a touchdown drive. Is that similar? Is that the same thing that, that you're mentioning? Uh, I don't know. I mean, he just played great. He played great. Uh, I don't even know the words to say it. I mean. He, it was a great performance by the quarterback and, uh, and many others. Uh, you know, there was everybody, everybody chipped in on this one, uh, played their hearts out, and you know, thank you to them. Were they playing him to run? Is that what opened up some other stuff? Yes, yes, uh, that uh, created some other opportunities in the pass game and the, and the running game for our running backs. What did you think of him, his attitude, his, his move through this tough? certainly opening moments of this game? Well, he just competes like a maniac all the time. Uh, in practice, in games, it's, it's always the, the same. You know, from, my, from what I'm looking in through the face mask, that's, that's what I, I see a guy doing. What do you say about Frank Gore? Uh, I really believe he'll be in the Hall of Fame someday. Uh, he is the, one of the greatest competitors I've ever met. Um, Tremendous performance by Frank. So a lot of your guys go right to Justin once the game was over. Yeah. Did you think about him right when the game was over? Did you did you see that celebration it, on the field? Yeah. No, I didn't see it on the field. Do you think about him when, when he's, <laughs> he's going through? Football? Yeah, uh, this is wonderful. Thank you to Justin uh, on behalf of the San Francisco 49ers. Um, everybody should have a Justin Smith. Everybody should. I'm glad we do. It was an easy decision to have Crabtree active for this game. Given, yes. Given the investigation, did you guys look into it, or does that not matter at this point? Um, I have no comment on that. You know, we we support Michael uh -huh. as our teammate.